Hey everyone, Steph here. I'm the Secret Slob and I'm so thrilled because it's finally Friday. I've been working on refreshing my routines and getting back into my weekly home blessing and all things fly lady the last couple weeks. I had a baby six weeks ago, so it's been a little bit of a process getting back into things, but I'm feeling so good and my house is looking as good or better than it ever did. And it didn't even take that long. I hope you've been joining me and refreshing your routines along with me and maybe adding a few extra things in that you've wanted to add. And then also this week, adding in the weekly home blessing. Maybe you have the time to do it all in one day, in one hour. I don't anymore. I have to break it up into chunks. So this week I chose to break it into three chunks. The first one I did was garbages and mirrors, which I paired with my daily swish and swipe that day. The second was changing my bed sheets and dusting, probably the easiest day of the week. And then today, the last day, we are adding the last part of the weekly home blessing, and that is vacuuming and mopping. And the reason I leave that until the last day, it's not some special Friday reason or before the weekend, I just didn't wanna do it. So I waited until the last thing. I feel like in the future, maybe that should be the first one. So at least the hard one is done first, and then garbage is a mirror is dusting. That's easy to do later. We'll see how it goes. So I hope you joined me and got some of that stuff done. Always remember, only take 10 minutes per task. There's no reason to go any longer. The whole point is just to do a quick once over of your main traffic areas. We're not moving couches or lifting rugs here, just getting you know, the basic areas of your house, or as my grandma would say, a lick and a promise, and you're done. So I'm gonna show you right now what I did for my routine today and what I added in for the weekly home blessing. And you'll see, I had my helper. I almost think I should change the name of this channel to Stephanie's children help her clean. Anyways, here I go. Hope you join me. My husband headed to work this morning early, so I'm unloading the dishwasher, usually he does that. And when I make my bed, you'll see that I don't have extra pillows or anything fancy. I just like to keep it super simple and easy for myself. I try to do all my towels one day a week and so I just run around to every bathroom and grab what I can. So here's my outfit for today. It's seriously cold here so this is it plus a messy bun. Getting things done. I like to do my swish and swipe right after I finish my hair and makeup for the morning because I'm already in the bathroom so it's just that easy. For my 15 minute declutter today I'm tackling more single night. Basically all I have to do now is give it a once over with a tea towel and it's done. Last thing of the night is just folding up my towels. I actually do fold my towels. I don't fold a lot of our clothes but I fold my towels because then they fit in the drawers a lot easier and I use the KonMari folding method and I love it. Okay so there we go that's it for my day and it's the weekend it's Friday night right now and I don't really do routines on the weekend. I mostly just hang out and even sometimes I wear pajamas all day. Um, I still keep up with my dishes and we just do some light tidying, but for the most part, I just 
kind of relax for the rest of the weekend. But if you feel like you want to keep going with routines or your house can't really stay together without them, go for it. It really just has to work for you. I hope you have a great weekend though and you spend time with people you love or just doing something for yourself. I will talk to you next week. Two more days left in our routine refresh. Bye.